Hello, Grandma DC here. Well, Halloween's over, and I couldn't be sadder. Well, I suppose I could be sadder. Everyone can always be sadder. But I do miss the holiday. Well, we've got more holidays coming up and more fun things to do for that, I'm sure. In the meantime, I'm still looking for, drum roll, the Holy Grail of bread. Came home, I've been working some double shifts, got home today and I thought, I want a meatball sandwich. I had some meatballs that I had made previously and frozen, got them out and unthawed them, and I thought, you know what, let's just try something radical. Uh, one of my subscribers, thank you Bits Bits, suggested dehydrating. This is an entire small head of cauliflower dehydrated. Now, you know, if you've got a dehydrator hanging out in your garage or under your cabinet and someone gave it to you years ago and you have no idea what to do with it, get that puppy back out. There's lots you can do with it. One small head of dehydrated cauliflower, and I'm putting it into my processor. Now, I riced it in the processor first, and then I put it into my dehydrator. You can put it on a Teflon or... Well, actually, parchment paper works good. You can put it on parchment paper in your oven with your door cracked open on low. You can dehydrate like that. Once you've riced it, it dehydrates really quick. And I'm going to pulse this into a powder. Now, uh, the big food processor didn't take it down as fine as I wanted. So I put it in my handy-dandy little one that chops it up finer. And uh, that worked really well. It has a... Uh, a pleasant smell. It smells vaguely of uh, cabbage but not real bad. And to this I'm going to add more flour type products. I think today I am going to use our oat flour. Now it is zero net carbs and I'm going to use the isopure whey protein powder which is also zero carbs. And we'll put a cup of each in here because I'm wanting to make a fairly large loaf. Okay. One cup of oat fiber and one cup of the isopure powder. My hope is that the uh, cauliflower in this will give it the texture quality that I'm looking for since we don't have any gluten in this whatsoever. Now, in order to stick this all together, we're going to use eggs. I would like to try this with egg whites someday, but not this morning. I'm in a hurry. <laughs> I think we're just going to put in whole eggs and I'm thinking I think we'll go with three whole eggs and salt salt makes bread good as grandma always said and I'm going to put a teaspoon of something to sweeten it a little bit um, stevia is my choice now I added a couple of optional ingredients to this and this is it after we blended it up and that is a really nice I think uh, consistency I am spraying my loaf pan and into that, I am going to scrape. I won't be able to see this. I'm going to scrape this out of here and put it into the bread pan. That's what I'm doing. If this is the holy grail of bread, oh, wouldn't that be nice? I don't know that it's going to be. Um, I just know I really wanted to try dehydrating and grinding up some vegetables that were low carb vegetables to use as a uh, texture enhancers for breads to see if it worked and we will find out in probably about 30 minutes uh, again we're going to cook this at 375 <laughs> and I'm going to uh, check on it at that time to see if it's raised and golden we'll find out 25 minutes and it certainly looks good well so far I am impressed with the way it looks and certainly the way it sounds. I'll get a knife and give this a try. Okay, so far so good. See a little steam still rise, it let it cool off too much. It has an almost bready smell. I do smell a little bit of you can tell there's something different in there on this cauliflower just give it a try that ain't bad it's still got that dry almost powdery dry cornbread texture 
more oil? I don't know. But it's getting close. I'm definitely eating my meatballs on this. And it's going to be okay. <laughs> well, tune in next time. Same bat time, same bat channel. We're still looking for the holy grail of low carb or no carb bread. Catch you later. Don't forget to like, share, or subscribe. It's going to be a long week. Ah. <sighs>